Alright, so we are here in front of the sword labyrinth, which you can clearly see the sword and the swordsman at bay right beside us. Now, we can choose to go to reds, which is literally right there, and then we can get some key scene and dialogue, but we will ultimately will have to be brought here to this dungeon. In which case, it's just easier just to go straight to the dungeon, because the going to red or not going to red before or after prior to this does not change anything. In fact, going straight here instead of to red actually saves you time because it actually it actually gives you a waypoint. So you can come back here as a shortcut to get to reds. Now, our main goal is that giant treasure chest up there as Yangus is about to tell us. There's the chest. The Venus tier is supposed to be locked away in that. Must be a real Oop. I was trying to move my arm and I hit the A button. This ain't the first time I've had a bash at this place. I ain't never managed to get as far as the chest, mind. But I ain't doing the odd with that at this time. We're gonna get that Venus tier. And without a map, we only are you supposed to go one way or the other. Let's try this way. We have Phantom Fencers. Astrals, so they have resistance to physical. And they have some pretty decent magical defense too. Also, they know some unique skills that we won't be able to learn. The Thunder Slash. We got Leather Kate. Ah, yes. One other thing. Jessica and... Well, the hero leveled up. So I was able to get to skill 59 for Spears, which gave us the... It turned our Thunder Thrust into Lightning Thrust, which will 100% crit if it hits. And Jessica, uh, she's got about 7 more points until she actually becomes a, uh, a healer, basically. Now, the other door is was a trap. There's the goodie bag I was talking about. This goodie bag has a rare drop item that is very useful for Jessica. And I won't be leaving this place until I get it. It's that good of an item. Should care more about this drop item than the Venus tier. Well, we got the normal drop, which is the gold racer. Oh well, there'll be plenty more opportunities. This place has four floors and plenty of hidden traps, and I do mean plenty. Phantom Fencers have a rare drop item called the Templar Sword, if I remember. And it's a sword that only Angelo can use. And it would be a great improvement to what he's currently running. And 
I have to run through poison. This could hurt. Oh, could, you, okay. could you not target the one I was going to target? Ooh, this is going to be a lot of damage. Oh, this is a lot of damage. Defeated. Okay, goodie bag drops a stupid gold bracer. Another cape. There it is, the Templar sword. Angelo's replacement item. There, much better. Damage is doing 50. And this is the map I needed. Believe me, the map really helps. Alright, poison does one point per walk. Oh, no. Okay, good. Magma Staff, really useful here. Angelo, can now DPS. Would have been better if you used magic on the stupid lost soul. It's kind of, you know. Tanky. Not yet, Yang is finally leveled up. Three skills, as usual. Up to 67, one humanity. Now his hatchet man has become the executioner. Three iron shield, a pair of scholar specs. Come on, a pair of scholar specs. Wisdom up by 15. Hold on, wisdom. Let's see, scholar specs. Let's see, was there something for scholar specs in my notes? Uh. something for I believe yeah that there's really not much yeah headgear okay there's nothing really uh, too keen with it, but until Jessica gets her... I mean, it's better than 5 points of defense. I get more power out of it. I'm not going to fret over 2 points of Poison damage. More restless. Let's see how much damage Crackle will do now. Mm. About five to seven extra points. 
Oh, really? One point? Well, times 30. Yes, relentless, another iron shield. Yes, I need quite a few of those for alchemy too. More restless armors until I get the one I really need. Flame slash does four nine. Uh, I think it was a iron Curtis was the rare item for this restless knight. My God, I have not seen Helm Splitter since the tortured soul. No, oh, iron armor. Oh, who can wear this? Oh, two of us. Uh, you know, hero needs more bulk. I might have to slay a couple of these fellas, get a couple iron armors. Alright, there's a dead end, but there's a chest down this dead end. Or was it a mimic? Or was I thinking of a different floor? This room has now this is why you needed the map you could easily tell that the one in the middle is a trap now I do believe that here might be a surprise that treasure chest might not just be a treasure chest Break all the pots. Break them again. Okay, it was just a locked treasure chest. Too many metals in one place. Another, another big hit was if you look at the floor, you could see two paradigms with the sword and the one in the middle didn't have a paradigm or a glyph decorative whatever floats your fancy okay now one of these is a fake probably the right one or not it's a kitty shield Well, Jessica needs a better shield. This one is... It's a canna box. The canna box draws near. Let's show off some... Boom. Amazing, huh? The canna box drops a pot lid. Which is its normal drop. Yep, more lost souls. Why would you cast Bang when your Magma staff is literally an upgraded version?
Another iron. Fail of magic water. Yeah, you want to be careful. You could. That's a trap right up there, and that'll send you right down to the bottom. Which is a, actually the closest place you can actually get to the map. But you'd have to backtrack quite a bit. Down here on the third floor, there's actually two rooms. Sweet. Zing has a 50-50 shot of reviving someone that has fallen. Alright, so we have to traverse some poison here. Hey! <laughs> Surprise! I wanted to do that just once. I really just wanted to do that just once to see how that went. Oh. You can't tell, but I'm chuckling pretty hard. for the first part of the actual test. Plenty of monsters. Bring it. Time-wise, how am I doing? 18? Not bad. Oh. Oh no, I might actually have to test out that zing pretty soon. No, or maybe not. Maybe not. They keep hitting my targets. Kamikaze. He kamikazed. Oh, well, we're almost there. This is the last room, or last floor, per se. Got more kamikazes. Can't make up its mind, can't make up its mind, can't make up its mind, blows itself up. Uh, there was that jet lag made me think he was gonna blow up.
It was worth it for the mini metal. Anything is worth it for the mini metal. I would use magic. I really would. But my wisdom's just too shot for that. You call that dancing? You call that dancing? I actually called it. <laughs> For once. Alright, enemies defeated. Lots of money. Another stupid gold bracer. Suit of iron armor. Another cape. Even though I will get a substantial boost, I want to keep it because fire and ice based attacks will be reduced. Okay, this one's just a simple pull swordman A to pedestal B. And watch as the hero looks ridiculous pulling this thing. Also, it's very touchy where you actually have to press A and you... Instead of just holding A. And you have to remember you have to unclick by pressing A before otherwise you'll be <laughs> it'll reset mummies all these mummies these mummies want their mummies but their mummies are mummies Tornado's carrying a mummy. Yeah, turban and another turban. More money for the casino. There's a second casino with a lot of good stuff. Oh no. I should have healed. I should have healed. Wait, is my MP low for Angelo? No, it's, no, it's fine. Why is it? Okay, heal everyone. Suit of armor, suit of armor, another iron shield, heal. This one. This is a fun one. We have to read the manuscript. 
look to the sky to see the path for above. Basically, you have to turn on first person view and got inverted controls. It reset on me. So I need to set one fella. to the second most there uh no did not mean to do that then I need to set this fella to the second most right here and then right there ta-da And you notice the music started to change? Oh, I can't run! I mean, after all, they're just lost souls. Come on. Alright. Venus tier. It's also a boss. So, heal up. Oh, everybody's good and healed. Alright. And we are at the... Oh, good. We're making good time. It's a trap box. And don't you look spiffy. This thing has quite a bit of health. And it's got some power to it. Good, I took out basically 20% of its health in one shot. It can also cast Snooze, which... Oh. Oh. Uh, two. Wow. Uh, I shouldn't push it. Oh yeah, nothing like putting the squeeze on someone to wake them up. That's it. If I fall asleep again. All right, that's it. Let's go Super Saiyan on his ass. Bye-bye. This trap box is done. The trap box is dead. And we obtain the Venus tier. And just like that. Well, I still need to get the item that I was originally wanting to get from here. All 
I gotta farm these goodie bags. Because they have what I want for Jessica. Which will gladly replace the scholar specs. Wow, the wind is sure is kicking up today. Turban, muscle. It's like the whole music for the whole dungeon just changed. It's like we broke it or something. Alright. So, we're basically done here until I get the rare drop from that goodie bag. I'll see you guys at the entrance once I get the stupid item.